It's everything that is self-destructing. Like every time I, I... I lost you for a moment. The lights in the whole house started blinking. They turned off. My phone was not even allowing... Like, everything went off. Caitlin, uh, are you playing with the electricity? Yeah. She says, oh. yeah, a lot. I don't even speak like that. I, I felt like I was in, a, in one of those scary movies. And I find things. So it's like, she wants to use my body to connect to other people and sabotage everything that is for me. Yeah. I've realized that in this whole process it yeah. makes a lot of sense right it's like i see three of them trying to hold on to me as they go do you feel the pressure mm -hmm. i actually heard a man laughing inside me they're belligerent fighters i feel like there's something right here that they're attached to that's what i saw when i had my eyes closed makes sense because this is the side where i have where i had that is the headache still there no, the headache, the headache went away. I guess they could control electricity in your house. It was like a movie. You had to, I mean, when I, when I looked and I saw the lights blinking, I was like, oh my gosh, the negative thoughts happen. It's more like a feeling of taking me to depression. Sometimes I, I start talking to myself and my daughter says, who are you talking to? And I'm like, nobody. It's that it happens a lot. It's basically it attacks me with whatever it is that I'm going through. Or if I did something that I didn't think it was okay, it's like a guilt that keeps taking me to a depression point. And it's kind of like a fight within myself. And I talk to myself like like if somebody's listening to me, and then it's a constant fight and it takes me to to feel like kind of depressed. Run for a glass of wine. And that's when I say that's self-destructing because Depending on the state of mind where I am, the next day I could wake up and perhaps not remember anything of what happened for lapses of time. Is it a thought or a voice that you're hearing? It's more of inner thoughts. Does it sound like you, the thoughts? It's like myself, yeah. It's like my own self in silence, putting those thoughts in my head. And me telling myself back, no, I'm not going to let this happen. Like a name like Caitlin or Kate keeps coming in my head. How old are you, Kate? 59 is the number that came in my head. Are you lost? Yeah. It's okay. like she doesn't know. It's like she's okay being there. She doesn't know any better. Uh, do you want to harm? Yeah. Do you enjoy hurting her? Yeah. Are you alone or are there others with you? There are others. Okay. What are their names? Like she's alone, but like I see like perhaps there's like people behind her, but she's she's like alone. What does she look like? She looks light skin, light grayish hair, down to here. She looks older. I sense that she's a smoker. It's very, oh, that's very possible because when I'm in low vibrations, my body tends to crave that in I personally not a smoke. I think you're getting her craving. Yeah, because let me tell you, the thoughts are of like feeling depressed and then wanting to go get like smoking, like self-destructive things. And then to try to get away from those feelings, I end up running to those things. But I honestly thought that it was myself, but it's in my head. Caitlin, do you like to drink? She likes just liquor, okay. wine liquor. Caitlin, what year were you born? 1958. 1958. Did you die of cancer? Yeah. Most likely throat cancer and she's been hanging around your throat it's everything that is self-destructing like every time I, I i lost you for a moment the lights in the whole house started blinking they turned off my phone was not even allowing like everything went off including the wi-fi and then out of nowhere the lights turned on now the light specifically where i am this one right here yeah that lamp was off yeah. The only way for me to turn it on is with the control remote or having it turned on. And this one turned on on its own. Caitlin, uh, are you playing with the electricity? Yeah. She oh. says, yeah, a lot. I don't even speak like that. I mean, she turned everything off. I, I felt like I was in, a, in one of those scary movies. She's sabotaging even possible relationships. I just noticed that. Now I realize that when I get weak, she wants me to drink. She wants me to do these things that I'm always saying to myself, I don't want to do it. And when I do it, my body gets weak. And that's when I don't remember the things the next day. And I find things. So it's like she wants to use my body to connect to other people and sabotage everything that is for me. Yeah. I've realized that in this whole process. It yeah. makes a lot of sense, right? Basically, she wants to live, experience life through you. Through me, exactly. And she's sabotaging absolutely everything everything would you like me to raise your frequency so that you can go to the light she doesn't know any better so i got the headache back how to transcend from 
being a spirit that that's hurting people to a spirit that can grow and experience unconditional love would you like to go yeah so she's uh, a tr to me she's a trickster she doesn't mean it it's like i see three of them trying to hold on to me as they go everyone has to go you guys don't pay rent so this is an eviction all contracts that you feel that you have with her are now null and void I'm going to squeeze you until you leave. You must go to the light. Do you feel the pressure? Mm -hmm. I actually heard a man laughing inside me. Pull, pull in your energy. One of them was Marco. They're belligerent fighters. So I'm bringing in my Octorian energy, Pleiadian and Orion, and now they're going to be pulled out. I feel like there's something right here that they're attached to. That's what I saw when I had my eyes closed. Makes sense because this is the side where I have, where I had that. No one's talking? No, I don't hear anything. Is the headache still there? No, the headache. The headache went away. I guess they could control electricity in your house. It was like a movie. You had to, I mean, when I when I looked and I saw the lights blinking, I was like, oh my gosh.